Hey, happy July 4th to everybody, all you Yankees out there, all you Americans, July 4th. So in honor of July 4th, why don't we do the obvious drawing, Captain America, because I don't think Captain Italy would be sufficient today. So let's look at it. Here's how we do it. Again, we'll do a quick little profile, one of them. Let me get my drawing here. Let's get a black. All right, so we'll, we'll go into profile. Look at this guy's going to be pretty easy because he doesn't have any hair. So you get... You get your handsome guy, right? He's gonna have his eye here, so make sure you get your eye in here. He's gonna have some highlights in it, but we'll get up in here. And you keep everything sort of the same. So, you know, again, you've got your your bridge of your nose. You're gonna come in here, gonna, you're gonna get, you know, nice handsome nose. We'll come up in here. All right, cool. I'll fix the nose here in a bit. And then you're gonna come up in here, and I like Cap to actually be sort of happy, so let's let's give him a bit of a smile. I think he deserves a smile since it's July 4th, and it's sort of kind of like a birthday for him. Uh, there we go. And then we're gonna give him the bottom, and let's give him a strong, strong chin, because, and give him a little sort of butt, butt thing right here, because I always thought that he sort of had a strong chin with a little butt thing in there. All right, and then we're gonna come here and obviously we're gonna, we'll give him a little bit of a dimple, right? Nice dimple there, got the eye here, and now we're gonna give him for sure a strong jaw. He has to have a strong jaw, why? Because he's Captain America and his mighty shield gonna come up in here we'll do good and then we're gonna come up in here we're gonna give him the ear remember his ear and I'm gonna do the old classic I'm gonna do the old classic uh, Captain America where he has his ear sort of exposed and then there'll be a little bit of a shadow underneath there he'll come up in here have a nice thick neck with a lot, a lot of shadow underneath here and again you guys are going Todd doesn't look like nothing. It's not Captain America, right? But all of a sudden, this is what happens with Captain America. It only takes a couple of moves, and all of a sudden, he becomes Captain America. So we get the back of his head. We give him a nice, strong neck. Back up in here. Give him some muscles so it just feels like he's strong. There we go. And now, how do we make him Captain America? Well, this is easy. First off, Captain America has a cow or, you know, a face cowl that's going to go here and unlike Batman that's sort of sharp you know it's kind of rounded so this is sort of lazy and rounded and then we come up in here and we'll go here I'm going to turn it here just real briefly so I can tighten up his jaw just slightly and put a little bit of detail here all right we'll come back up in here now that we've got that then we have to cut out where his eye is unlike Batman this piece here where his eye is is actually fairly, you know, it's 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 open pretty wide, right? So make sure that when you draw this piece right here, it's open pretty wide. It's not like it's hidden and that he has like a slit eye like uh, Batman or something like that. It's pretty wide up in here. We'll give him, you know, his nose up in here. And now it's starting to sort of take a little bit of shape and you're going, okay, I'm starting to see it, Todd. So there's only really two more crucial things that we need. And that would be, of course, he has to have his A. So this really sort of will cement that this is Captain America because he's got his A. I probably sloped that a little bit too much. We'll put it, oh, nice color, Todd. We'll slope it up this way. And then the last piece of the equation was, if you guys remember, he used to have these cool little wings here. So we'll put these wings up in here. I'll come in and clean that up in a bit. I'll add some more detail up in here, up in here, and then you just sort of finish it up in his hair here. So, you know, you get a couple of the key things. This is what I keep saying. Even though most of the heroes are all handsome and they all look the same, if you can get a couple of the key elements that make that hero who it is, I'll clean this up a little bit. There you go. Put a couple of dots in there. And now the only thing really sort of left to do is, you know, do you want to put some shadows in it? So if I go up in here, we'll give him some shadows in here. Boom, a little bit of shadow up in the nose. Not too much because, again, this, you know, Captain America really isn't, 
isn't uh, Batman, so he doesn't have to be overly dark. You know, you don't want to you don't want to get sort of too silly with them. But you come up in here and just give them a little bit of shadow. Whoa, what happened there, Todd? Uh, and then maybe maybe we'll give them just a little bit up in here, right? All right, all right. And now I come back in with my brush, and I can do a little bit of feathering, right? Put a little bit of feathering here. Put a little couple feathers up in here, up in here, just to just to make it a little more reasonable, all right? Show the teeth a little bit. Put it up in here. Maybe shrink the chin just a bit and put the butt crack back in there. There we go. Uh, and this would be up in here, some kind of shadow on his ear. Maybe fan it off a little bit here. For sure on the back of the head, you know, because again, you want to give a little bit of depth on the back of the head when you're drawing something. And then we'll come up in here, give him some strong neck muscles, right? You can always do whatever kind of feathering you like up in here. And then obviously if I had some more, you know, space and you could see his chest and I could put the big star on his chest, then for sure, then you go, oh, Captain America, that's him. He's a tough dude. So we'd have the big point. So I'll just put a little bit of the point right here, maybe a little bit of the star right here so you can see it and you come up in here and you add your lines and and remember he used to also have stuff where he had scales it looked like his uniform has scales so you can actually take the time and add scales to it that actually adds sort of a nice sort of element and a nice design so you could fill that in up here and up over here but very quickly as you can see you get into it so for all you great people on July 4th and all the Americans that are celebrating it and all their friends and families. Thanks for watching and happy July 4th to everybody. Enjoy your family and everybody else. Be good. Dodd out.